So I'm here with Bill Weber from Case IH, and Bill, uh, I noticed we have a new quad track, the 785, but uh, one of the things that really jumped out to me, and I'm sure everyone that's walked by, is the, the throwback color of this this particular Steiger. Uh, is this uh, is this just a, just for the show, or is this something that's going to be offered in the Case lineup as far as the color scheme? Uh, it's not going to be offered in the Case lineup. This okay. is a special edition tractor. This is our largest four-wheel drive that we've built, okay. 785 horsepower. Uh, it's the first time that we have factory built a quad track in green because quad track is a case IH development uh -huh. but we wanted to pay homage or respect back to the creators of stagger the three stagger brothers okay uh, so we created this tractor being since it's our largest horsepower most productivity and stagger is known for productivity power to the ground and innovation and that's what this tractor represents so if you notice right below the door it's got actually Doug stagger who is still alive uh, his signature underneath the door and everything else we uh, it, it related to the stagger family yeah um, they were here yesterday took a bunch of pictures and everything else so a lot of respect goes back to the innovation and the leading tractors as far as power to the ground when it comes to four wheel drive. Yeah. well i know that the, the tractor itself is uh i mean it's really eye-catching really really love the respect and the homage you're paying to that but as far as the 785 aspect of it is that above the uh the, I guess the uh, DEF regulation, or does this tractor still have uh, This depth? tractor still has okay. depth. Okay. So one of the misnomers is, is yes, you get above a certain level yep. uh, kilowatt-wise that you don't need to meet emissions. Well, we still need to meet certain levels yep. of emissions. The solution set that we have here at Case IH and CNH is we use depth and we allow the engine to do nothing but produce horsepower. So that's why you see us have a 16 liter engine that's up to 785 horse because we don't use the engine in trying to recirculate exhaust gases or anything along those lines. So the key factor of that engine is to produce horsepower and put it to the ground. Okay. That's going to be my next question. Is this the same engine that was in the 715? Uh... Same engine, okay. but there's been changes. So we've updated the pistons, the rods, the injectors. Um, we've also beefed up the transmission to take the extra horsepower. Now that beefing up the transmission is going to go down through the entire line. Okay. And we've also made some changes as far as the gears within the drop box and within the axles themselves.